Hey guys and welcome back to Iron Beautiful Hustle TV. Today I will be doing a easy peasy lace wig install and this wig is by Suburb Wigs. Now this wig is an HD lace wig and as you guys know HD lace is very popular today. Um, the reason why I love this wig and I love this company and this is my um, second time reviewing them because one they have HD lace wigs and all of their wigs come all of their HD lace wigs come pre-plucked with the knots already bleached as well. So this is really a wig you just take out the box and begin to install. This wig does come with some uh, clips on the inside as well as the uh, removable elastic band. And as I mentioned, the hairline is already pre-plucked. Now, most people don't really know the difference between HD lace and, you know, a regular uh, Swiss lace. HD lace is very, very, very like top notch uh, transparent. So in other words, no matter what skin tone you are, when you, once you put this lace up against your skin, the lace will technically disappear as I showed you um, putting the lace up against my arm. And this lace is also very, very thin and it can easily be ripped. So you must be very careful when using this HD lace. Now for today, I will be doing a easy glueless installation. And before I even begin to lay down my wig, I'm just going to take my Ruby Kisses foundation in level 15. And I am using uh, the darkest shade right now. And I am just applying that foundation all over the top of my cap. And then I will mix both of those colors together and apply it all over uh, the inside of my lace as well on the top of my lace as well and that will also make this lace completely melt and disappear into your skin as you will see later on in this video now this is a curly wig that they sent me and all the details to this wig will be listed below and i highly highly do recommend this company like the quality of this lace is just like so bomb and it's hard to find vendors who really really have like the real hd lace a lot of them lie about having it but I know real HD lace when I see it. So um, moreover, I'm just gonna go ahead and apply that foundation as I mentioned on both, you know, underneath that lace and on top of that lace. And as you can see, like that lace is really like melting already and I haven't even applied my wig. Now, usually, you know, when I install my wigs, I cut the extra lace off afterwards, but I'm just gonna go ahead and cut the extra lace off now uh, from around my ears and just adjust my wig to fit perfectly. As far as styling today, I just wanted to do just a basic install. I didn't want to do no part. Um, so I just pretty much installed it, like spread it the hair mostly to one side and then just wore it as is. No baby hairs, no nothing because it is super, super duper natural after installing. Now, um, what I'm using today to put down my wigs is um, the bed head masterpiece um, like holding spray and as you know if you've been watching my channel for some time now i absolutely love this spray i got this spray i restocked on it from tj maxx and i paid 12 dollars for a two pack so it's about six dollars each the first time i got it i got it on a really really great sale like it was literally going for two dollars and three dollars for the um full bottle but you know, just try to go to stores like TJ Maxx, Ross, um, you know, those little stores like that that have all the name brand at a discounted rate. Definitely check those uh, stores out before you go and purchase these products like at the highest, fullest price they will sell it for. But um, as you guys know, like I said, I absolutely love this bed head styling spray. It holds so good and it's just, it dries so easily. So I would just actually, you know, go section by section and use that spray to lay down my wig. Now I am gonna go ahead and start cutting that lace off. I pretty much sprayed this side down first as a guideline, and then I will actually cut the extra lace off on the other parts before sticking it down, but I did want to get, um, you know, that little, like my guideline um, melted on down first. That way it's easy for me to uh, apply the rest of my wig. But when it comes to the transparency of this lace, as you can see, like as I'm cutting off that lace, you don't even see like where the lace starts or end. And that's why, like I say, I highly recommend HD lace. Like it is the most bomb lace out right now. 
Um, and they also have something called Femme Lace, which I've never tried before, but right now I am just loving this HD and this wig as well. Like I said, I've worked with this company before and they gave me the same quality, different patterns. The first time was a HD lace wig that I have installed up on my myself and it's also on my video, I mean on my channel as well. And it was a straight HD lace wig that I got from this company as well. So make sure you guys check, the, uh, check that video out as well. But yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and continue to just um, spread that bed head and just using my fingertips and pushing that lace down into that spray, making sure it sticks really good. And I'm just gonna repeat the same thing from one side to the next. Now that I have a finished applying all of the hairspray, I'm just gonna comb it out just a little bit and cause I'm gonna go in with my wax stick and also my hot comb and just kind of press the roots out a little bit. I don't want it to be too, too like straight, just enough to where it can just, you know, be kind of smooth and just fall how I wanna fall. So um, like I said, I would not be doing a part for today. I did not want a part. I just wanted the hair to just be in its natural state puffy and curly. I really didn't like soak and wet it um, as I usually do uh, with curly wigs. I just really wanted that fullness and puffiness because I was going out after this honey. So I just wanted my lace to be melted, natural looking, puffy and full. So I just, you know, hot comb the loose out just a little bit because like I said, I wanted to look as natural as possible and just be free, be itself. And today I'm going to be going in with my baby. I know you guys have not seen me use my Nairobi Smooth in a very long time. But for this glueless melt today, I decided to whip out my baby off of my dresser, honey, and put her to use. So I will be taking that Nairobi Smooth and applying it all over my hairline. And you do want to do this quickly because it does cause that lace to lift. So I just hurried up and dabbed it on there. And I'm going in with my beautiful Hustler Melt Belt which is back in stock make sure you guys make your purchase all orders purchased today will ship out asap so yeah go ahead before they be sold out once again honey they're only five dollars per shipping fee whether it's you know international or in the u.s it can still be shipped to you so just go ahead and make your purchase on my website which i have listed here on this video but um in the meantime i did let that melt belt sit on there for about 10 minutes i just walked around the house did a bunch of pointless stuff probably torqued a little bit who knows what i did child but once i finish i am back and i am removing this scarf and you guys would really see like the melt honey listen okay y'all see that that thing is melting honey Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And I am just going to take my rat tail comb and just comb it out just a little bit. Not all the way because I like that little pushback look that it gave. Um, you know, it gave. Ooh, child. I can't even stop looking at the hairline, y'all. Doing my voiceover. <laughs> Feeling it, period. Yes, ma'am. So this is pretty much how I wore my hair. Like I said, I just wanted it to be like natural, wild, type of on a messy, cute type of vibe. And I'm gonna zoom in on this lace for y'all because I really wanna give y'all this what lace tease. So I'm really gonna zoom in and let y'all see that all close and personal, honey. Let me just, up, up, uh-oh, there it is. Zoom, honey, yes, ma'am. And that's the definition of what lace. 
but I hope you guys did enjoy this easy breezy beautiful install and it's just a little video child when I had got ready to go out or whatever I was thinking some little Wayne but that's neither here nor there but if you haven't done so already just go ahead and subscribe to I Am Beautiful Hustler TV because we got more videos dropping till next time